Hello guys, good afternoon, welcome to my channel. So today I am here with one more recruitment notification from NPCIL, that is Nuclear Power Corporation of India, a very huge name in India's PSU history. So it is a Government of India enterprise um, which is present in Uttar Pradesh, head office in Uttar Pradesh. So it has um, released my notification for many posts. So any degree, any degree, degree students can apply. So it is a golden opportunity for you all students. So now let us look into the details. Let us go into the details of this. So you can see the uh, names of the posts. So the uh, posts which are uh, uh, which are useful for us is uh, these three, these four: Steno, Assistant Grade, Assistant Grade One, HR, F and A, and C and MM. So these four, these are the four posts that any uh, degree holder can apply. So if you are uh, eligible for other things also, you can see stipendary trainee, mechanical, electrical, electronics, pharmacist, nurse, operational theater assistant, stipendary trainee for a maintainer category two and category three. So these are different posts, but um, the, for any degree students, uh, six, seven, eight, nine are the useful posts. So now let us see into the details now. So for uh, nurse, uh, the initial payment will be of 40, 44,900 and the age limit is between 18 to 30 and stipend will train 18 to 25 and um, stipend will be provided as per the uh, CPC norms, that is 18,000. And uh, pharmacists, eight, uh, age limit is between 18 to 25, where the initial pay will be 29,200 in the level five of revised pay structure and operational theater assistant 21,700. So let us see into the details of our posts. So assistant grade HR, assistant grade F and A, C and MM and Steno grade 1. So the age limit is between 21 to 28 years and the initial payment is of 25,500 which is a very good payment for these posts. So and also age relaxation as per the category is provided and also a person with disability can students can also apply according to their uh, eligibility. Now let us see into the uh, educational qualification. So for nurse, um, these are the different uh, 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 requirement, uh, but uh, let us directly go into the post which we can apply. So see, yeah, this is the things. Assistant grade, assistant grade 1, assistant grade C and MM and stenographer. So in these th for these three, any bachelor's degree with minimum 50% marks in aggregate from a recognized university. So the, uh, if you have 50% marks in degree, then you are eligible. So and also the essential requirement for skill test. So these are the common things which are asked in everywhere. So 30 words per minute typing speed on PC in English. So if you practice for one week also you will get 30 words per minute speed. So if you have this you can apply. And also um, uh, Steno grade 1. Any bachelor's degree with minimum 50% marks in the aggregate from a recognized university. So uh, speed of 80 words per minute in English stenography and preference will be given to those candidates who possess knowledge of Hindi and uh, English uh, stenography speed. So these are, these are the important eligible criteria uh, for these four posts and uh, for other posts also you can see according to the notification. And also the payment is provided in detail. And one more thing, let us go directly into the exam. Yeah, you can see here uh, for the posts of assistant grade 1, HR, F and A, C and MM, Steno grade. So there are two exams that is preliminary test and advanced test. So in preliminary test, you will be uh, screening. So the screening consists of general knowledge and uh, current affairs, computer knowledge and English. See, here also computer knowledge is mentioned. So these are the three things which will be used. So uh, there uh, one hour will be provided for this examination. And uh, the maximum marks is for 150 marks. So three marks for every question and one mark for negative, negative uh, marking. And uh, there are also qualifying standards, so that, that there is nothing like uh, you have to score, uh, uh, you have to score a minimum of such marks. So if you have 40% uh, uh, for marks for general category and 30% for SC, ST, OBC, and PWD, so applicable if vacancy exists in relevant reserved category. And for the advanced test, you will have having quantitative aptitude and critical reasoning. See, these are the portions that you study every day for all the exams. So if you uh, are thorough with these uh, topics, then you can easily crack this examination. So this will be for uh, 25 and 2050 questions. So uh, there will be three marks for every question and one mark for negative marking. So um, these are the complete details of the recruitment and there is no fees. So no fees. You can just apply it by going into their website. So no fees and uh, you can also see the uh, exam pattern is also provided and the minimum amount of marks that has to be scored. So based on the merit list, uh, then you will be selected. So it is a golden opportunity guys because uh, the recruitment is from NPCIL which is a very huge name. So if you uh, get into this uh, corporation then it will then um, uh, then, uh, then you will be having a very good working work experience. So that's all I can say. So that's all for today guys. If you like this video please like it and share it with your friends. Thank you.